Amar has recently added a new distro and here it is. So this is bad as it is a Debian based distro and in this video we will be installing it not only CLI but also with GUI. So let's get into Tumbox and first make sure that your repos are up to date package update. Then just install put distro package install put distro. Now if we do put distro list here is our distro. So let's quickly install it put distro install address. Then just log into it put distro login address. Now first we need to update its repos. So execute app update. Next we will set up a local user so that you don't mess up with your root file system. For that we need to install some basic packages. So execute app install sudo nano and y for yes. Then execute add user and your username. Create a password for your user. Next we need to add this user in sudo's file. So that we can use sudo with that. So execute nano slash etc slash sudo's. Go down and here write your username. And just copy and paste this. Then save the file. Control X, Y and enter. Now log in with that user, super user and your username. Next we will create a shortcut to log in to this distro. So that we don't need to again and again execute that big command. So just exit from here. Now execute following. Echo root distro login dash dash user and your username that we just created. Add s. Right arrow dollar prefix slash bin slash add s. Then we need to give executable permission to it. In word plus x dollar prefix slash bin slash add s. Now we can log into it just by executing add s. So now we have Pardes installed but still we don't have that nice GUI. So let's quickly install it. But before that we need to install some dependencies. So execute sudo app install udix and y for yes. Now execute following to fix basic stuff. Then execute sudo app install rds dash xfc dash desktop and y for yes. Now this will take some time depending on your internet speed and device. So wait till it is finished. Add is installed. Next, we need to install VNC server to access it. So execute sudo app install ivnc dash standalone dash server. And again, y for yes. Now we are done with installing all the stuff. So let's quickly start the VNC server. Create a password for it. Then kill the VNC server. Next, execute following nano dot vnc slash x startup and add following to it. Then just save the file. Now we can start the VNC server. Then go to VNC viewer. Click on this plus icon. And in host write localhost colon 1. And give any name to it. Click on create. Connect. Enter your password. And here is our part dash desktop. Now first we need to change this display resolution. So go to applications. Settings. Display. And select according to your device. Click on keep this config. Next we need to apply themes to this distro. So go to application, settings, appearance and select r dash dark or light as you want. Then click on icons and here also select r dash dark or light as you want. Now again go to application, settings, windows manager and here also select r dash dark or light. And now we are done with theming. But the wallpaper doesn't look good. So just right click, desktop setting. And select the wallpaper you want. Now it looks good. Next to configure this panel, follow all screen instructions. And that's it. Now our desktop looks good. Hope you liked it. Go, go and try this new distro. And share your thoughts in comment. And most important thing, subscribe.